All right. Well, it is Friday morning, y'all. Friday, 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 Friday. Uh, that doesn't mean anything to me. <laughs> you know, uh, how a lot of people are like, oh, it's Friday. I get no, it's Friday. I get to go to work, and I get to go to work tomorrow too. Anyway, uh, Debbie suggested that I, you know, maybe take you on my ride to work on Friday. You guys know I work at a local theme park, and um, I've been doing that for golly, coming up. This is coming up. Uh, um, whoo. Five years. The sun is bright. Uh, coming up on five years, and um, and, and I and I sort of took the uh, I sort of applied for the job on a lark. Really, I just I saw a sign at at, at at the park, and I went home and I got online and I applied and I thought I would you know make a little extra money, and I thought I was going to do parking. <laughs> I don't know. Maybe the. Uh, the onboard person saw that I was maybe a little portly for that, and uh, yeah, yes, one of those old words, portly, and maybe suggested that I do um, guest relations. I don't know. I don't know whether it was the way that I was interacting or whatever, but anyway, so I've been doing that, and in um, July, on July, it'll be my uh, my, my fifth year, so uh, part time, super part-time I mean incredibly as part-time as a part-time job can be <laughs> once a week once every two weeks I mean a, a part part is just, just fractional uh, just enough to keep my free tickets but uh, anyway so I'm heading over there this morning it's a beautiful morning um, gorgeous you flip you around this is, there you go, at the risk of getting in trouble with Geico. Um, this is our neighborhood. Somebody's building a house finally on this lot, and that'll be cool. Right by the river. Oh, yeah, they're building a house. I was just wondering what that was. So... Deb suggested that I take you guys on a on a journey with me or a little trip. So, headed to work this morning. It's gonna be bright, su bright sunlight, bright light, bright light. Big fireball in the sky. There we go. When they widened this road here, which is major thoroughfare to th our area, they put in these traffic circles roundabouts. Now it's taken the citizenry a little a little bit a little bit or a minute to to figure out how to how to, how to operate it. But I think that we're good now. Now the thing when they were building them, uh, the drifters came in and and thought it was a perfect time to 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 drift their cars around them. So we'd get up in the morning and it'd be all sorts of rubber marks and stuff, but yeah. That's ended finally, I guess. All right, so. I don't know how many of you who uh, watch the channel live in in Tampa, but uh, if you do, you probably recognize this street. And up ahead there, I don't know if you can see it, is one of our roller coasters. And that should give it away. <laughs> That should give it away. Uh, today, I think I also, I think uh, Miss Debbie has scheduled a, um, a hair appointment for me. And you, you guys saw my beard. It's kind of right. It's kind of raggly. Uh, so I hope we'll get that straightened out. And my quaff dealt with. And I'll take you, I'll pick you guys up as I'm leaving work this afternoon and dropping by the, uh, the barbershop which I don't know if you'll be able to see, is right there. There you go. There you go. Tillman's. Good dude. Super dude. All right, so... Um, yes, people flying through here this morning. I don't know about you, but 
you know, I'm I'm a, I'm a person who, as you can see, there's a there's one of our roller coasters, and if you know roller coasters, you know exactly where I am. I'm gonna stop here. There you go. You know exactly where I am. We've already got a tour bus leaving. It's great. That means it's probably going to be busy. And busy is good because busy is good for what? It's you make sure you have a job, right? Uh, if your if your place of uh, of employment isn't busy, then chances are you're not you're not going to have a job there very long. But so it looks like we're going to be busy. Anyway, um, you can see you some of you can see the sign over there. Let me. Wait, 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 wait for it. Wait for... Oh, where is it? There we are. I have to be careful about moving the, uh, the, the camera, the phone, because we're on this program with, with uh, our insurance company. Yeah, the buses are pulling out of there. Um, that... Gives you a discount if you don't use your phone while you're driving, and one of them is handling the phone. Anybody else doing? Anybody else doing that? How, and how's that working out for you? Um, auto insurance in Florida is high. It's high. It's ridiculous. It's 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 criminal. Is what it is. Uh, and ours has gone up by let's see, almost thirty three percent over what it was our last six month term. 33%, a third. So I get a hold of them and I, and, and I say, hey, what's what's the deal here? Um, and the person gets on the uh, on the chat and says, you guys are doing great. You're doing great. You're one of our best customers. And we've only been with this company, uh, I don't know, since, since our kid was started to drive and he's 33 now, so... Uh, it, it just seemed ridiculous, and we, and we've got all these programs where they get to spy on me uh, if I'm using my phone, if I'm driving too fast. I mean, all this stuff. And what I know is that if I, you know, if we get off of of, of all of that, then it'll really skyrocket. There we go. Let's see here. Got to be super careful here because there's traffic coming. And here we go. There we go. You know, it's funny when you're <clears throat> when you work at a at, at, at a public place like this, or a theme park like this, when you um, are coming in and there are no people here. It's kind, of, you know, when it's you know, either at after closing or, or you know, like now before opening, it seems kind of weird. All right, we're going to come this way, and then <clears throat> we'll go down here, and and, and everybody, and I, I can't take you back back behind the the guard shack. But um, this is the entrance coming in. And when I come in, I can sort of see um, that big thing over there. I, don't, I can't move the camera. Uh, that you might be able to see is Iron Gwazi, and then there's Cheetah Hunt and uh, some other coasters. We can sort of see what's operating today. So, we, so we'll kind of have to enter into Shikra. So we'll kind of know what kind of day we're going to have. You know, it's not a good day when Iron Gwazi isn't working. People are mad. And look at all these folks here. I think they're kids here. Yeah. All sorts of kids, all sorts of children here. Um, oh, yeah. Because um, we're in, it is, what's, what's this month? March? Oh, April. So school's going to end and, and, and kids are taking their eighth grade trips and that kind of stuff. Again, I can't take you behind the wall. Uh, so we will uh, go ahead and flip you around. Uh, hey. So we will get back with you after we get to the guard check. All right. Well, we're 
we're back. We're at the end of the work day. It's about quarter to three. I've got the sheet close to three o'clock. I've got an hair appointment that my wife said for me. You know, I never thought that I would have a hair appointment. You know, COVID kind of caused this. You know, dudes were like, when it's time to go to the barber, I mean, you just go to the barber shop, right? And you sit in the barber shop with a bunch of other dudes waiting to get their hair cut, and um, that's kind of how it went. You wouldn't get an appointment, right? You knew that you were you were lucky if there was nobody in front of you, but you wouldn't get an appointment. You'd have a hair appointment. Kind of, kind of, kind of change. Some for the good, some not so good. Anyway, we're leaving. We're in front of the guard shack, so go ahead and picture of me leaving. It was busy today. Uh, it's a gorgeous day. Uh, the car says it's 84 degrees outside. It was 65 when I got here. And Debbie and I have talked about that before. This is the this is the weather where you'll lose a sweater or a jacket for sure. I mean, you you may wear a light you know a light jacket or something on the way from the bus in the morning. 65 or so, or maybe cooler than that, and uh, 90 degrees on the way home, so uh, you're not going to wear it home. You dropped it on the PE field, or, or in the lunchroom, or in the classroom, or in the library, or wherever, in the band room, but you, it definitely isn't going to make it home. <laughs> Alright, so we are, we are headed out. Stop's going to be at the bar. My appointment is at 3.15. It is at 3 o'clock now. There's no reason to rush. We had somebody in the chair. He's not going to rush him out. And they definitely don't, they definitely don't finish up for him. he was on was cool on the phone because if I don't cool the phone it'll you know do what phones do when they get hot in any case we got to get in here thank you again and uh, we'll see if we pick you up on the way out
Tell your doctor if you have a heart condition or high blood pressure before taking it. Don't take Restream more than prescribed. Restream may increase your risk of thrush, pneumonia, and osteoporosis. Call your doctor for some breathing, chest... Alrighty, well, what do you think? A lot better, huh? Yeah, yeah, I think so too. I think I think Miss Debbie will think so too. All right, I got my hair cut, and now I'm headed back home. It's been a uh, it's been a pretty full day. We'll see how Miss Debbie's doing and her work day's going. She had she, she went in early today, like she was she was on the job at seven, seven at uh, seven a.m. Yeah, so that's pretty early. We'll see how our work day went, and uh, we'll get back with you later on another video. Thank you for subscribing. Thank you for uh, sharing and commenting. And just like just like always, always remember, never forget, we love you, and there's nothing you can do about it. Peace.